Hey students, today we're going to learn how to make a Microsoft Word document. Um, to get to our Microsoft Word, we're going to get, go through Clever. A Clever can be found in modules. Uh, there's a link probably in the top of your teacher's module. So let's go to Clever right now. You know, when you're trying to click something in modules, you can't click over here in this white space. It's not going to get you anywhere. You've got to click the word. So let's go over here and click Clever. Let's follow the link. All right, so here we are in Clever. Gosh, there's lots of options of different places to go. That's good, and a lot of times your teachers will tell you exactly where they want you to go in Clever. But today we're trying to get to a certain place, so let's make sure we go and find it. The place that we're looking for is right here, Office 365. So whenever you're trying to type a document in Microsoft Word, Microsoft Word, that's where you're gonna type your document, you're gonna look, go look for a place called Office 365. So let's click on it. Now sometimes it's gonna ask you to log in. It may give you a couple of prompts. Just go ahead and click through those prompts to log in. Now if you notice, there are lots of different options up here. Today we're gonna to make a Word document. But Outlook, just so you know, Outlook is your email. OneDrive is where you go to save documents. Microsoft Word is what we're working on today. There's Excel, there's PowerPoint. OneNote, Teams, Sway, there's lots of different ways that you can do work and your teacher may ask you to do lots of different things. But again, today we're working on Microsoft Word documents. So you're gonna click Word. And then you're gonna make a new blank document. So let's click the plus sign. And just so you know, the reason that we're doing it this way, your Chromebooks do not have Microsoft Word preloaded on them. The way that we make our Word documents is through Office 365, through this online Word application. That's how we're going to make our Word documents. So that's why I'm showing you through this video. All right, so this is our Microsoft Word document that we're making. So let's say that's the document that you wanted to make for your class. Now let's go and save it. Now you notice, well, before we go and save it, I just wanted to show you, you have all the commands that you need up here, just like you do for the, your other Microsoft Word. You can go and you can change fonts. You can do things like change the size of the font. You can change the colors of the font. You can highlight things. You can make bullets. You can do all kinds of stuff. All right, so now let's go save it. You go to File, Save As, and here's where we're gonna name it. Now look, you really need to make sure you name your documents because if you leave it as something like Document 12, you'll never know what that document is. It's gonna be hard to remember what Document 12 is. So let's name this document something like um, Microsoft Word because that's what our assignment was about and now it's saved and our document is now saved to this place called the cloud and the cloud is a place where all of our documents um, at our school are saved. It's up in this Office 365. It's a pretty cool place um, where all of our work will be saved. Our PowerPoints will be saved there. Everything will be saved there. It's pretty cool how everything works here. All right, so that's how we make Microsoft Word documents in case you need to turn something in. I hope this helped you.